IT Fundamentals for Cybersecurity Specialization. It's an introductory learning program on Coursera. I have to say it has been doing quite well on the platform so far. Over 50,000 students have joined it and there are more than 5,000 reviews. With a general rating for this specialization 4.6 out of 5. My name is Daniel and today I am going to talk about the IT fundamentals for cybersecurity specialization from IBM. In this video we will discuss things like course overview, course content, pricing, certification, career opportunities. And as always, I will go over some student reviews and tell you what I think about this program. Also, I will left all course related links in the description down below. So feel free to check them out after watching this video. Let's go! Course overview I think I will start by saying that it's a small introductory program. There are just four courses here that will take you about two months to complete. From what I have read, some people even manage to finish it sooner. And since it's introductory specialization, you don't need any prior experience or college degree to apply. Some basic computer skills should be enough to enroll. And I think that's great, because I'm sure there are a lot of beginners looking to get into cybersecurity. And this specialization can help them a lot. So, what will you learn here? During this specialization program you will pick up knowledge about cybersecurity tools and processes, system administration, vulnerabilities in operating systems and databases, various cyber attacks and the basics of networking. And on top of all that, you will learn about super important cybersecurity things like cryptography and digital forensics. So, it looks like quite a lot of serious content for a small program. But don't worry, folks. The instructors here know how to explain complex stuff in a simple way. Course instructors. Speaking of instructors, it's a traditional thing for IBM to get teams of experts to work on their educational programs. In this case, it's just IBM Skills Network team. There are no specific professor names, but you can be sure that people teaching you are top notch professionals. Course structure and content. Guys, before we move on, I try to make educational content in an entertaining way, make it fun instead of boring. And in return, I just ask to like this video and subscribe to my channel, if you enjoy the content I make. That's all. Ok, and now let's see what this specialization program looks like on the inside. Well, guys, like I said a little earlier, there are just four courses to complete here. Introduction to cybersecurity tools and cyber attacks. This course helps you understand the basics of cybersecurity. You will learn about the history of cybersecurity, different types of cyber attacks, and why they happen. It also covers important terms, basic system concepts, and key tools used in cybersecurity. Cybersecurity roles, processes, and operating system security. This course helps you understand the basics of cybersecurity, covering roles in organizations, key processes, operating systems, and the concept of virtualization. Cybersecurity compliance framework with system administration. Here you will pick up essential commands crucial for identifying vulnerabilities in operating systems. The course covers endpoint security and patched management, vital for keeping systems up to date and preventing cybersecurity incidents. You will also learn about cryptography and encryption, network security and database vulnerabilities. And the final course teaching you the basics of keeping computer networks secure. You will learn about things like local area networks, TCP IP, and how networking affects the security of computer systems in a company. It also covers the parts of a network that help defend against cyber attacks. These courses will take you 15 to 20 hours to complete, with 4 to 7 modules in each course. You know, folks, after reviewing the content in this program, I cannot say it offers some intense hands-on experience. But that doesn't mean it's all theory. You get to do quizzes in each module and there are graded assignments too. Also, the two last courses in the program have a big final project, where you can test your skills. All in all, I don't think that the lack of practical assignments is a strange or bad thing in this case. Because you have to remember, it's just a small introductory program. It's there to give you a basic understanding of cybersecurity fundamentals. And from what I have seen, it does that well. Price and certification value. 
Alright people, let's talk about the price of the IBM IT fundamentals for cybersecurity specialization. In short, it's not free. Um, um. On the other hand, I don't think it's all that bad. This specialization only takes two months to complete. And in fact, you might complete it even sooner. That's why I think the price is pretty reasonable. Now guys, let's talk about certification. When you finish each course in this program, Coursera provides you a completion certificate. But the real deal is when you complete all the courses, then you earn an IBM badge. That shiny badge can definitely give you a boost to your LinkedIn profile or your resume. And let's be honest, considering it's just a small basic specialization, the knowledge you get here is far more valuable than this certificate. Career opportunities The favorite question of my subscribers – Daniel, does this certificate help me get a job? My friends, let's get real about job prospects. If you are hoping to get a job and wondering if this certification will do that trick, well, not exactly. Because this program would magically make you job ready. It's more of a beginner-friendly journey into cybersecurity. And landing your dream job will likely require more. You have got to keep boosting your skills, diving into more learning and getting ready for interviews. In a nutshell, your job success depends more on your effort than just an online certificate. Student reviews Alright, let's take a look at student reviews for this specialization. I have found lots of positive feedback, but there is some criticism too. It looks like people love that the program is beginner-friendly, but still offers a decent amount of challenge. They enjoy the content delivery too. On the other hand, some students complain about the lack of interactivity. And some people found certain parts of the course a bit too challenging for beginners. Let me show you a few reviews I found. Here is a 4-star review. These four courses gave a lot of information. Thank you to IBM and the team for providing us the wonderful opportunity to learn something. But I would recommend that it could have been more useful if instead of slides, they were more interactive and live demos. And here is another review. IBM courses are the absolute best on Coursera. Instruction is straightforward, easy to follow and detailed. I recommend all IBM courses. Is IT fundamentals for cybersecurity specialization worth it? Alright guys, let's wrap this up with a crucial question. Is this specialization program the right move for you? Well, guys, it may not be perfect. Are you sure? But I don't see any major reason to skip it. Especially if you're a complete beginner looking to get into cybersecurity. It's a solid pick for complete newbies with zero prior experience. On the other hand, if you're already familiar with cybersecurity basics, this might not be the right choice for you. In this case, you should pick an intermediate level or advanced level programs that will help you to grow. Alright, my friends, that's all about the IT fundamentals for cybersecurity specialization by IBM. I left all course related links in the description below, make sure to check them out. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, thanks for watching, until next time.